eyes open, heart clean, and my mind focused. Hi, everyone. Greetings from 2K Sports. Get ready for some NBA action. Clark, the focus tonight has to be on the front court matchup. Here we go. It figures to be a battle of big men down low. Well, you know, Kevin, no question about it. These are two very talented teams in the post. I mean, each used to owning the advantage in the paint, and I'm very interested to see the chess match inside tonight. And now the Golden State Warriors. And it's Anthony at the elbow. There's the pass to Black. Sweet move. Here's Wagner. And the rebound goes to the Warriors. That's a surprise. I mean, really out of character for him to miss when the defense is not right up on it. Thompson with the bucket. And their offense already shooting to jump out to this league. Quality looks they're getting, and they're capitalizing on them, guys. They have to be happy with this start offensively. Forget about going for the long-range bomb to cut into that lead. Just take it to the hoop, my friend. And how brilliant throwdown. Exercising his authority. And he goes up strong with one hand and flushes it down. Boy, the incredible court vision of Paul. He gets the ball to his guy, the more personal he'll become. Anthony on the wing, defended by Paul. Here's Black. He's gotten some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. Ingles in the corner. Once again off the mark, Orlando. And even with good coverage defensively that time, he has confidence to drill the three. Trains it from beyond the arc. Thompson. Here's Suggs. The offensive rebound. Count it, and the Warrior lead has been cut down to two on the bucket from Wagner. Wagner's got his second bucket of the night. Ball outside, and he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. It's on Paolo Bancaro. Paul plays with such force and smarts combined. I mean, he looks for contact and does a good job of. And the Warriors miss again. And the Magic with possession. They're on an 11 to 3 run. A crossover, and it's laid up and in by Harris. Harris, a decent ball handler, continues to work at improving that part of his game. Paul dishes to Green. Passes it to Thompson. Golden State moving it around. Here's the three. That balls. Their rebounding has been excellent, and that's always important in a close game. The Magic have gone an even 50% from the floor here in the third quarter. Four of eight. Here's Carter, and then Carter with the dunk. With the nine-foot standing reach, Carter has no trouble putting that away. Green dishes to Paul. Green with a screen for Paul. Kicks it out to Wiggins. Here's Looney. Cans it from downtown. He's got Holtz in sun. And it's Wagner in at the five down low. So that's the lineup on the floor for the Magic. Fultz against Joseph. Wagner has screen on green. And Carroll passes to Wagner. Over Looney. And it's Wagner missing. And thus far, they've managed to overcome an off game from him offensively. Thompson from long range. And he's good on the three ball. Stay patient on the offense. Make the extra pass. We don't have to make up the deficit all at once. We'll see if they start shooting a little better. Kevin? Thanks, David. Here's Wagner. Buries it down low. Textbook play inside. Wagner doing everything right in that case. And it's Paul with the ball for Golden State. A great fourth quarter, just giving up two points. Thompson from long range. And a Paul. Carter pulls it in. Carter's got double-digit rebounds now in the game. Greg, they're in a rhythm offensively, really cooking. And the opposition looks helpless to stop them right now. Oh, just solid on the one-handed slam. And guys, when it's a tight ball game like this, he's the guy they want with the ball. Somebody you can count on. He is an extremely reliable finisher. I tell you what, he is one guy you do not stand in the way of. Make some noise. It's time. For your 
Agner passes to Cook. Cummings, that is the guy to go to. I mean, when everything's frenetic, Carter has that steady, even kill pulse. And an intentional foul right there. Gets the first, that puts them up by five. Second one is good. Gets bailed out by the miss. He usually converts that. Here's Holmgren, covered by Jokic. From deep, Gilgis Alexander. Nikola Jokic grabs the miss. For Denver, they've gone one for three so far. That one off the back iron and out. Clean look from mid-range. Coach will probably want to run that play again. And slam dunk by Gilgis Alexander. Such a smoothness and ease to the way Shea Gilgis Alexander plays. And the ball is tied up, so we'll have a jump ball. Jump ball. And so it's Oklahoma City with it. It's Dort on the wing. Williams a screen on Porter. Dort with it. Checked by Gordon. And Williams punches it home. And this kind of six slam is just one of the reasons this team. No good on the triple. Thunder with a lead. Giddy passes to Williams. Now Gilgis Alexander. Williams with the screen. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. Boy, when the conversation turns to the young stars in the NBA, I think it's hard to leave Shea Gilgis Alexander off this list. Pass to Jackson. Back to Najee. Here's baddest one. Dort defending. And again, Denver no good. Listen, that's a shot he can make, but obviously the defense okay letting him shoot it. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. Boy, very hard not to be impressed with the young Australian Josh Giddy. This is a, a young guard who can do absolutely everything. And Doris, a nice assist from Jackson. How about that pass from Reggie Jackson? Right on the money, folks. A minute nine left in the first quarter. Now Kitty. Now here's Gilgis Alexander. Oklahoma City's got to hurry. They got to get up a shot. Gets the three ball to go. I thought they were outworked and outplayed in just about every phase of the game. Maybe that's one of those situations where you say, hey, let's move on. Outside Gilgis Alexander. And he draws body contact. Looks like a blocking foul. He was in the shooting motion, so he'll head to the line. I think what you love about Shea Gilgis Alexander is the size, athleticism, and instincts he brings to the position. Then there's Jamal Murray. Wing shot on the way. Here's Najee. Boom! He jams it straight down. Grabs the board and goes right in for the putback. I love it, B.A. Yeah, wanted to close the gap. Makes sense to get aggressive on the glass here. Pass to Wallace. And here's Oladipo. Dort for three. Knocks down the triple. Dort's got... Victor Oladipo's passing skills probably unappreciated. This guy is very unselfish and capable. The Thunder have really struggled the last couple of years. Yeah, remember back when they had Durant, Harden, and Westbrook? Oh, quite a lineup. Not that they need three superstars again, but they need some sort of boost. And it's amazing. Their slim advantage on the board seems a lot larger than it is. Let's check in with our reporter, Ali LaForce. The Nuggets have gotten two of five shots to fall this second quarter. To the paint, Porter. And the deficit down inside single digits. Porter's got his first basket of the night. Well, that's not the guy you want guarding him at the rim. Just too much of a differential in terms of size. And Nikola Jokic 
breaking barriers at the center position, Greg. Oh, so true, B.A. That 2,000-1,500 season, it never been done before. The Joker's ability to be a back on track. Well, first of all, they just, they have to relax. They can't panic. It's still early in the season. But, of course, it's on the leaders of each team to set the tone. They need to make sure everyone is locked in and on the same page. Williams passes to Wiggins. Here's Wallace. Pass to Holmgren. Whoa! And the dunk to finish it off. Oh. The next two quarters are any different from the first two. So far, it's been a runaway. It's been a clinic out there by Nikola Jokic. And just halfway through this contest, he's already registered a double-double. That takes a level of aggression and a level of focus, and he has brought it all night thus far. Tandem at the one and the two, it's Gideon Gilgis Alexander. Then there's Lou Dort, then there's Holmgren, and it's Williams in at the four spot. That's the lineup for Oklahoma City. And how about that replay? Man, you gotta freeze the glass on the layup. So Dort's got eight points. Listen, that is all you can do defensively. Lou Dort at times is just going to make tough shots. Murray for three. Here's Jokic. Here's Caldwell Pope. They get it back. Tries yet again. And Gilgis Alexander with a block. The drive by Dort. Ooh, a two-handed power slam. That is Lou Dort coming with bad intention. That kind of individual play could spark his group. Pass to Holmgren. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. Dort proves there's no one way for an NBA journey to go, Doris. There's no question about that, B.A., because, listen, we associate success with the young guys with being a high draft pick. Fact of the matter is there has been plenty of second-rounders and even undrafted guys who've had big-time NBA careers. And I love the fact that Dort... Pokashevsky in the post. Quarters there. The offensive rebound. Great D that time from Porter. Boy, nine times out of ten, that's going in. I'm sure he surprised himself with the miss. Jackson outside. Tipped. And here's Giddy. And he slams it in one-handed. A six-foot eight. That's excellent. Subjective. And it's going to be out of bounds. The Thunder will retain possession. Substitution on the court. From deep, Holmgren. Oh, got it off in time, but it's no good. And so it's the Oklahoma City Thunder earning this break in the action, up 10. And their defense has stood out, wreaking havoc for the opposition. Back after this. Gordon outside. Murray with it. Pass to Naji. It's rebounded by Oklahoma City. Holmgren's got nine rebounds in the game. Boy, he's getting it done. Here's Pokashevsky. Oladipo on the wing. It's a three-pointer. Well, the rise and fire. Active hands and feet. And it's come up big a few times for them. Second chance points have also been a big part of what's happened in this game. Crashing the boards with authority, turning those opportunities into second chance points. Boy, big time, big time on the offensive glass. Williams into the lane. Oh! oh no. <laughs> Just rising up to the rim. Man, when he gets up there, he gets up there. You know what I'm saying? And how about our AT&T 5G? Gets up there, he gets up there. You know what I'm saying? And how about our AT&T 5G slam cam? Couldn't have captured that play any better. Murray against Giddy. Down low. Here's Jokic. And it's Holmgren with a rebound. Thunder with a lead. Giddy passes to Williams. Nails it from beyond the arc. Well, you have Point game. Outside, Williams. Outside, Gilgis Alexander. There's the three. Denver grabs the miss. 
and just not enough time for them to get back in this game. I'll tell you, it's never an easy point in the game. Knowing whatever you do, you're still coming away with the L. From second round pick to an absolute star, Jokic can burn you in many ways offensively. Giddy, got it. Good job in the low. An absolute star, Jokic can burn you in many ways offensively. Giddy, got it. Good job in the low post. And the Thunder lead by nine. 16 seconds left in the fourth. And here's Porter outside. And it's Kitty with a rebound. Williams is screened on Murray. From deep, Kitty. It falls. And now a 12-point.